In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to run the shallow cross concept out of the tight slots offense in Madden 23. This comes out of the Indianapolis Colts offensive playbook. If you guys want to check out my entire Colts offensive ebook, make sure you get into the Patreon. So we're dropping a brand new ebook this week centering around the Colts playbook. Now we're going to be taking a look today at the play mesh spot. I think this play has a lot of potential and just a lot of value. And we're going to show you how to run kind of a shallow type of cross series uh, with this concept. So what we're going to do with Mesh Spot here to enable this to consistently beat man and zone is we are going to create this shallow cross. What we're going to do is we're going to take the left side receiver here, Debo Samuel. We're going to put him on a streak. We're then going to take Calvin Johnson and we're going to leave him on this little drag. I like to go ahead and block my tight end and then we're going to take our running back and we're just going to put him on a block and release route just like this. What this is going to do is it's a very simple little route combination um, but really we're looking to hit this route to calvin johnson right here across the middle of the field it's a really good route against man coverage and it's pretty good in the zone as well you could leave the mesh play just like this if you wanted to as well uh, and just do double drags but again this isn't really shallow cross this is mesh right so we want to run the shallow cross concept now another thing that you can do uh that you can do with this is you could take calvin johnson and you could put him on a slant and you'll see here, the slant is also going to get really good separation against man coverage. And you can kind of do the shallow cross concept at different depth and uh, have, you know, varying levels of success. Now, another route that I want to go over is this route to CD Lamb. If you smart route this route against man coverage, you're going to notice that this route is going to light up. And he is going to cook man coverage across the formation just like that. Now, hopefully he catches the ball. But I do think you need to smart route the route, especially if you're running this against uh, man coverage. Because when you smart route the route, you're going to notice that it's going to run significantly better. And you're going to have a better chance of him, him lining up consistently against man. Okay. Now, the other thing that I did want to go over is with shell cross, you always want to have... Uh, some kind of go route, right? Some kind of clear out route. That's what Debo Samuel's route's for. If they're playing press man on him, because he has the short out elite ability, he is going to be pretty decent at kind of attacking man. You'll see here he's going to light up. So what we're just going to do is high point and throw it up and over the top of that corner. And as you can see, he can put himself in a position where only he can catch the ball uh, really well against that coverage. Now, uh, another thing that we're going to do is show you this play against zone coverage. And again, not too much changes. The one thing is if they're playing more hard flat coverage, then I really do recommend this, this slant route to Calvin. Um, you'll see right here that if they're playing hard flat coverage, you can wait on this slant. and You can actually throw this against hard flats over the top. But if they're playing more like, let's say they're playing like curl flat coverage out of like a cover three defense, then the drag becomes very helpful because you'll see here the drag is going to run a little shallower and you can actually throw it against a curl flat just like that so you can kind of use your own um you can kind of use your own you know advice here uh, another thing you can do with this play is if you motion cd lamb out you can take calvin johnson and put him on a smart route in and you can run the shallow cross uh, to the left side as well with Taysom Hill on the drag. So there's some versatility with this concept. Really shell cross is simply a 10 yard dig with a slant um, of some type or a, a shallow route of some type. Could be a slant, could be a cross, right? Whatever you want to do. Um, but there is some versatility. Now the next route on this play against zone is really this route to CD Lamb. You want to freeform that down once you see the safety kind of turn uh, turn their hips backward uh, and it's going to give you the ability to put the ball kind of in a spot where only your receiver can catch it just like that right there now if it's cover three um, you'll get a little bit cleaner um, of a separation you'll see right here you can kind of wait on this all the way and again just put the ball you know to where the receiver can catch it so a couple different ways to run shallow cross if you want to run it more um, let's say you want to run it more like this now it's kind of going to become a really good man meter for you because you have your in route to take some hit or your drag to take some hill and you have that little in route to calvin johnson 
which is very helpful. And then you still have C.D. Lamb's route. It's just C.D. Lamb's route's not going to be the big hitter against zone uh, as much as it's going to be a really nice route for you against man. So I'll show you his route against man if you motion him out. You'll see he's going to be kind of getting that separation more in that pocket of the defense. Now, if you run that setup against zone um, and you just motion him out, again, this just creates space, right? Motion is just creating space. And now we can send more people on a route. You'll see you can throw that right in that little pocket. And you see how it just kind of helps the spacing a little bit with this overarching concept. Guys, uh, this formation, tight slots, halfback week is extremely versatile. There's a lot of things we can do with this play and this formation in general. But this is how I like to run the shallow cross concept. If you want to get my entire, all my ebooks and updates, make sure you join the Patreon. Link is down in the description. Ten bucks gets you access to everything. Thanks for watching, and we hope to see you guys over at the Patreon page.